Hey, Andrea and the team at Home Spa Collection. I was just taking another look at one of your listings here and I wanted to uh, put together this quick video. I know it's been a little while since we've spoken. And so I just wanted to share some tips and tricks and insight uh, as to how you can get more traffic to your listings and also increase your conversion rate as well. Uh, so I just want to jam pack this with value. I'll get right into it. So uh, the first thing that I was looking at is the traffic, how you're currently getting traffic. Now, I did notice, you know, that you've got obviously got good brand recognition here. The Dr. Lift brand, a lot of people are kind of familiar with you. You're ranking really well for certain keywords like antibacterial, body wash. That's a keyword that's getting 2,700 sales on it, and you're ranked number two. So you're doing incredibly well on that keyword. You're showing up in basically the top spot. Now, what I did notice, though, is that you're not doing a whole lot of advertising. You're only running about 188 sponsored keywords. And we typically run about a one to two ratio between sponsored and organic. And so you could really be running closer to about a thousand sponsored keywords and still maintaining a good A cost and doing that to grow your sales and get more traffic and more exposure. Now, the other thing too uh, to consider is looking into what we call strike zone keywords. Those are keywords that you're ranking on on the bottom half of page number one. And so if I look in here, there's going to be some good keywords like, um, I guess that's a branded keyword, but let me actually sort by search volume and see. So antibacterial soap, that's a good one. Uh, and surprisingly, uh, it's got, well, not surprisingly, I should say, it's got 9,000 people searching for it. And it's got about 1,500 sales that are being made on that keyword per month. And surprise, here's the surprising part is that you're only ranking number 36. So that's that's a pretty low rank. You're showing up kind of at the bottom half, like maybe 60, 70% of the way down the page. So you're really not getting conversions on that keyword. Uh, here's another one, you know, a few, some, some more in here. And so these are great keywords to target. And by the way, there's about almost 200 of those keywords that you can really, again, move up the page because you're at the bottom of the page one and you can really focus on those keywords and rank higher up on the page if you focused on them. And so, just one example there, but um, I think your listing itself is is pretty good. You know, you've got over a thousand reviews. It's got good ratings. It's priced competitively. I think the thing though that I notice is that you don't have you only have four images here, uh, so you're allowed to have six images plus a video, uh, and then also plus a plus content. You do have a little bit of a plus content, but it's not a whole lot. It's pretty pretty uh, pretty sparse here as far as an a plus content section goes. So you can really add a lot more. Uh, and not just, and, and then also too in the main images. So I wanted to share with you, actually, this is one of Steven's listing, uh, listing Steven, the founder of my Amazon guy. And it's also a soap product, uh, you know, and what he's doing here, he's got nice infographics. He's got some lifestyle photos. He's got another cool lifestyle photo there, followed up by another infographic, followed up by a video. And then if you scroll down, he's got a nice brand story talking about his brand. And then he, well, he's also got some really um, what's called premium A plus. So this is pretty cool. You can actually put in a bunch of really cool things in here. Um, and it's just a really nice kind of um, representation of an A plus content section. So it's something that you have access to as well. And so uh, I'd love to jump on a quick call. Hopefully I gave you some tips here. Last couple tips that I would give with you to give to you too, is you do want to write a little bit longer title. You don't have to go crazy with it. I'm not talking 200 characters, but Right now you're sitting at 88 characters. That is pretty short and you're gonna get more value out of adding a, a few more keywords in the title. Maybe just another you know, 20, 30 characters, nothing crazy again, but just to rank higher for some of these keywords in here. The other thing too is same thing in the bullet points. Now here you can be a bit more liberal as far as adding more keywords and doing a little more keyword stuffing. You also wanna push this other competitor down the page. In this case, it actually happens to be one of your, own, one of your uh, other products. But typically, this will be like a, a competitor listing that you want to push down the page uh, with longer bullets in here. So hopefully that makes sense. And again, my calendar links below. I look forward to talking to you soon. A lot we can do. And uh, yeah, I look forward to it.